What if your dreams aren't just dreams? What if a deja vu isn't just a glitch? And what if you have already traveled the multiverse without even realizing it? Chapter 1. The Multiverse. Not just sci-fi anymore. The idea of a multiverse used to be the stuff of comic books and sci-fi. But today, scientists around the world, including here in Germany, are taking the idea very seriously. In physics, the many worlds interpretation of quantum mechanics suggests that every time a decision is made, reality branches off. One version of you takes the job, the other one doesn't. One stays in Germany, another moves to Australia. It was first proposed by American physicist Hugh Everett in 1957, but German researchers have taken it further. Chapter 2 – The German Connection – Science meets Speculation Germany is no stranger to cutting-edge science. And when it comes to alternate realities, we've got some interesting minds digging deep. Take the Max Planck Institute for Physics in Munich. While they're not openly researching the multiverse per se, their work in quantum field theory touches on reality's most fundamental building blocks. Then there's the Max Planck Institute for Brain Research exploring consciousness itself. German neuropsychologist Dr. Ernst Senkowski even pioneered research into instrumental transcommunication ITC, recording voices and images from other dimensions using electronic devices. He believed we might be receiving broadcasts from other layers of reality. Ghost radio or multiversal hotline? Chapter 3 – Dreams, Astral Projection and Other Realities Let's get weird for a second. Have you ever had a dream so real it felt more like a memory? Have you ever woken up convinced that something changed? Many esoteric traditions, including some rooted in old German mysticism, believe dreams are gateways to other dimensions. In fact, modern day practitioners of astral projection claim they consciously travel to parallel versions of Earth, what some call the etheric multiverse. And here's the kicker. Many of them report seeing the same places, the same rules, and even the same entities. And no, these are not all stone teenagers. We're talking doctors, engineers, even former skeptics. Chapter 4 – The Mandela Effect – Collective Glitches Ever remember something a certain way, only to find out the world insists you're wrong? Like the Berenstein vs. Berenstein Bears, for example. Or was the Berlin Wall yellow for a while? This phenomenon is known as the Mandela Effect. Some theorists, including a few German psychologists, have explored it as evidence of parallel timelines, subtly merging. If the multiverse is real, maybe our consciousness is drifting between versions of reality. And we only notice when the seams start to show. Chapter 5 – Synchronicity – Signs from the Multiverse You ever see 1111 again and again? Meet someone who just dreamt what you were about to say? Carl Jung, who was Swiss but heavily influenced by German esotericism, called this synchronicity. To Jung these weren't coincidences. They were meaningful, like the multiverse responding to your inner state. What if synchronicity is your higher self and another reality nudging you through the veil. Chapter 6 So, are Germans contacting other realities? Maybe not with spaceships or wormholes, but with dreams, symbols and strange moments of knowing. Maybe we already are. Whether through science, dreams, altered states or quantum experiments, Germans and humans in general may be far closer to the multiverse than we ever imagined. The only question is, are we ready to listen? What do you think? Have you ever had a multiverse moment? A dream that felt like it bled in from another you? Comment below. I want to hear your stories. And if you enjoy these deep dives into the hidden corners of science and soul, you know what to do. Subscribe and as always, stay curious, Stay connected and don't forget
to get Germanized.